Okay guys, this is Beck from Oz. I've got some breaking news. Okay, so heads up for people in Alaska. Um, now this hasn't been reported by the media, but apparently there is a tidal wave on the way. There are 45 plus foot waves out in the ocean out from there. And uh, I've just been on to a plain truth. Uh, uploaded uploaded a video just now. It was Cindy Gary. She's onto it. Um, also, guys, go to Dutch Sense. Dutch is all over anything to do with earthquakes and stuff. Now, there's one thing that the mainstream media are not reporting on, and that is the fact that there are thousands of people without uh, power in Alaska, Anchorage, and places around Alaska. There, it's winter. Well. Of course it is, it's the third day of winter there for you guys, we're third day of summer. I mean, they do these things in, in winter for you guys, you know, like, they're just trying to kill us, and you guys. Okay, we get myself together here. Cindy also said, made a couple of very valid points that I already thought of. I was going to make a video about it, but I'm just going to blurt it right out now. George W. Bush dying. Now, I did not know about the Nibiru sunsets over there. I do not believe in Nibiru, guys. As such, I do believe that the Father will bring in Wormwood. I don't believe we live in a, in a place that there's space and planets. I believe we live in a closed system and that the Father will bring in Wormwood. She said on the morning of George Bush's death that the skies were all red, you know, and anyway... Just watch the link below, you will hear what she said about that. And I'm like her, I, I very much don't believe he's even dead. The first thing I said was, they're going underground. They're going underground. I know something's going down, we all do, we know something's going down. Nobody's believing us. Okay, so, I'm going to get myself together here. I've been in prayer this morning so much. Um... Okay, so get on to Dutch Sense. Dutch is all over it. The USGS hates Dutch because they with, withhold things and Dutch doesn't. So anybody that the government hates, us truthers, we're the ones who want them. And Dutch is a true man, you know, like he's just trying to help us guys. Okay, so what's your earthquake forecast? Um, I have been following the caravan crisis. I, come on, guys across the road let's go i honestly think it's a decoy guys i think it's just something to come on get away from that oh yuck jazzy um i think it's a, a decoy for what's really going on um i think it's more uh i, I think the judgments are falling guys okay but people in alaska please please or if you know somebody in alaska my american viewers please tell them okay let them know heads up okay look the tsunami mightn't be so big when it reaches the land but i mean even a i have seen the results of a, a, a 10 foot tsunami and it's just devastation okay you don't want it you've got to be able to be warned to be to be able to get away you know this is just wrong okay um Wormwood very well could be coming in. Uh, not, well, they want to call it Planet X, whatever. Wormwood very well could be coming in. The judgments are falling. The judgments are falling. The judgments are falling. Okay, everybody, just get on your faces and pray. Pray for your families. Pray for the world. I was so praying for America this morning. Pray for the president. Father, save us all. Father, they've pushed you too far. They've pushed him too far. The satanics, they've come out in the mainstream, you know, the music, <laughs> our media. We know all the signs and symbols, us people who have been here for a while. And, um, oh, praise the Father, Brazilian cherries. Thank you, Father. I'll eat one of them. I've got to calm down. I'm just... I can't believe they keep this information from us. Mm, that's really nice. Organic fruit. No pesticides. 
just pure fruit from the father. They're called Brazilian cherries. So they must be in Brazil, I guess. Um, I am so sorry. I'm really emotional today, guys. I, I just... I can't handle this being lied to. None of us can. Or, you know, it more so that not being told what's happening so nobody can prepare. It's sick. They're sick dogs. They're sick dogs. No, they're not dogs. My dogs are so good. They're sick. I don't know. I don't know. The father has a word for them. I don't. Hang on. I can't conjure up anything that's worse than mass genocide. This is just the Holocaust all over again. Okay, that's what it is. I've rambled on enough. Go watch the video I've linked below, please. Pray. Pray Yeshua, the blood. Pray the blood of Yeshua. It is real. It is real. This is the true battle. This is the end battle of good and evil. Look at these hounds of hell. And poor things never get out of their, their backyard, so I know that they bark, but they're so vicious. I don't even walk mine on a lead. They're so calm and beautiful. All right, guys, check out the link below. Please let me know what you think. Leave your comments. Like, share, subscribe. Please share. Let people know this is going on, please. In the name of Yeshua, Hamashimak, I pray. Amen. This is Beck from Oz. I'm off.